spread spectrum transmissions are limited to 10 watts and above 222 megahertz. The European Conference of Postal and Telecommunications Administrators, the CEPT, allows U.S. amateurs to operate from most European countries without an additional license or permit. Certain Central and South American countries allow U.S. operators to operate without an additional license or permit under the International Amateur Radio Permit, the IARP. The Federal Communications Committee Commission can also grant a temporary authorization for an activity which would normally be illegal or against the rules, such as the STA for experimentation for a limited number of amateurs on a frequency of 500 kilohertz. When using a transceiver that displays the carrier frequency of phone signals, which of the following displayed frequencies represents the highest frequency at which a properly adjusted upper sideband emission will be totally within the band? The answer is D, 3 kilohertz below the upper band edge. What is the first action you should take if your digital message forwarding station inadvertently forwards a communication that violates FCC rules? The answer is A. Discontinue forwarding the communication as soon as you become aware of it. Which amateur stations may be operated in races? Answer C. Any FCC licensed amateur station certified by the responsible civil defense organization for the area served. Within what distance must an amateur station protect an FCC monitoring facility from harmful interference? Answer A. One mile. Which of the following statements concerning remotely controlled amateur stations is true? Answer C. A control operator must be present at the control point. What is a telecommand station in the amateur satellite service? The answer is B. An amateur station that transmits communications to initiate, modify, or terminate functions of a space station. Which amateur stations are eligible to be telecommand stations? B. Any amateur station so designated by the space station licensee, subject to the privileges of the class of operation license, held by the control operator. Who is responsible for the proper conduct and necessary supervision during an amateur operator licensee examination session? The answer is C, each administrating volunteer examiner. What are the consequences of failing to appear for re-administration of an examination when so directed by the FCC? Answer A. The licensee's license will be canceled. What is the National Radio Quiet Zone? The answer is C an area surrounding the National Radio Astronomy Observatory. Under what circumstances might the FCC issue a special temporary authority, an STA, to an amateur station? Answer A, to provide for experimental amateur communications. Your homework assignment is to read Chapter 4 and to address the study questions listed here on this view graph.